Football is a game loved all over the world. Nationally, it's played by thousands and watched by millions. But it does have a problem. Racism. Ultimately, no other game or area in life, if you are being abused or there's intolerance, do you have to stand for it. And it's not right that that continues to be OK in football. Raheem Sterling has said that the press should shoulder some of the blame in the way reporting is different for black players as opposed to white players. But John Barnes, in a recent interview at the University of Winchester, says... So I don't believe in institutional racism. I believe in individuals who may be racially biased, who go into an institution which allows them to either abuse people at football matches or as a, as a policeman arrest them, or in normal life, not give somebody a job. Sports Minister Mims Davies outlines the government's stance. So intolerance and ongoing bigotry in stadiums using the cloak of football as a way to continue to be racist is not appropriate. And also other leading sports people such as Joe Root saying it's inappropriate to be intolerant when you're on an elite level. You should be using your role to make sure that people watching, young people aspiring to be part of sport, see that it's a good place to be part of. They want to participate and above all, it's not a cloak to be discriminatory or indeed to be intolerant. It might be 2019, but when will racism end? Ian Sheridan, Eastley News.